and we're back with Let's Play Mass Effect 2. Where we left off, we had just finished Zaid's loyalty mission. Got that over with, because I will probably never use him again. I don't like Zaid, he's an arse. So, yeah. I mean, he's a well written arse, but he's still an arse. Commander, you've received a new message at your private terminal. Okay, what we got? Talitha. Um. No, I don't remember that. I believe it was from the original Mass Effect, but I can't remember exactly where that was. Ah, the consort! Okay. Cool. How may I help? Is there anything no. I should know? Okay. Anything else? That'll be all. Good. I'll be here if you need anything. All right. Well, I'm thinking. Let's see. Let's go talk to Joker. See if he has anything enlightening to add. Probably not. If not, then I'll just go away. Commander, that's it for now. See? No, yes, Shepard. Ah, that's all for now. Did not mean to do that. Commander, I assume everything is going well up here. It was until the thing started questioning my every move. It won't let anything slide. <laughs> you were deliberately falsifying maintenance reports, Mr. Moreau. <laughs> not falsifying, tweaking. I always round up on task times. It makes us look good when we come in under. <laughs> Harmless self-promotion. Edie can ease off on that. Very well, Shepard. <laughs> yeah, go pout. I win. Joker. <laughs> right, right. No hard feelings. Good game. That's it for now. So oh, boy. Needy and Joker. They're like a married couple or something. <laughs> That's a kind of a creepy thought, actually. Anyway. Um, let's see. Who? What do we want to do next? Let's go... fuel because we run out like crazy I'm not gonna do the firewalker stuff just yet I'm going to go recruit recruit the convict another character I'm not particularly fond of but anyway the prison ship purgatory. Yes. Dock in here. Who do I want to take with me this time? Well, Garrus, of course. I mean... Yeah, in Mass Effect 2, I always have Garrus in my party. Because he's really helpful for picking off enemies at a long range. But who else don't? And as you can see, we can cycle Zaid's appearance now like that. And Garrus and Jacob, just for kicks and giggles. He can be our close quarters kind of guy. Okay. Let's skip that particular cutscene. Somewhat ominous. Welcome to the Purgatory, Shepard. Your package is being prepped and you can claim it shortly. As this is a high security vessel, you need to relinquish your weapons before <laughs> no we. No or go to hell. I can't do that. Everyone stand down. Commander, I'm Warden Kira, and this is my ship. The weapons will be returned on the way out. You must realize this is just a standard procedure. <laughs> it's my standard procedure to keep my gun. <laughs> Glare. Let them proceed. Our facility is more than secure enough to handle three armed guests. Or is We're it? We're bringing Jack out of cryo 
As soon as the funds clear, you can be on your way. If you'll follow me to our processing for the pickup, Commander. Let's go. Cell Block 2. As you can see, we keep tight control over the population. Yeah. Each prisoner's cell is a self-contained modular unit. I've blown a few out the airlocks as an example. Jeez. The ship is made up of 30 cell blocks identical to this one. We house thousands of criminals. We can put the whole place in lockdown on a moment's notice. Not bad. Nothing goes wrong here. Can you tell me about Jack? Cerberus hasn't told you. Jack is the meanest handful of violence and hate I've ever encountered. Dangerous, really? crazy, and very powerful. You'll see soon enough. Oh joy. Maintaining a population this size in space can't be cheap. We can cut corners that governments can't, and each prisoner brings in a fee from his home world. These individuals are violent, and their home planets pay well to keep them here. What if they don't pay them? What happens if the home world doesn't want to pay? We explain that we can't maintain the prisoner without their help, so we'll be forced to release him back onto his home world at an unspecified place and time. <coughs> Extortion racket. You don't have to agree with my methods, but don't question my motives. These are despicable people, and I'm keeping them locked up. How'd you end up running this ship? I was in law enforcement on Palavin. Palavin is the uh, Turian homeworld. Out into the galaxy to carry on with their crimes. Bounty hunters aren't dependable. Eventually, I hit upon this idea: keep the criminals in space, and the galaxy is a safer place. Hmm. You do this because you think it's necessary. Every day, I see the worst sapient life has to offer. Governments are soft, unwilling to make the hard choices. Someone had to stand up and make the galaxy safe. All right, let's, let's keep going. With this place like this, there must be escape attempts. We're in space. They have nowhere to go, and they know it. But still, we exercise extreme caution. These are dangerous individuals. <laughs> we have many ways to control the population. I'm going to confirm that the funds from Cerberus cleared. Our processing is straight down this hallway. Just keep going past the interrogation rooms and the Supermax wing. Hmm. I'll catch up with you later, Shepard. Hmm. Something doesn't seem right about this. Hmm. You don't even get good information that way. After a point, victims admit to anything to make the pain stop. Is there something I can do for you? There's no excuse for beating a prisoner who can't fight back. This is a massage compared to what his victims went through. This is beneath this you, though. This you as much as him. We have orders. You're not important enough to make your own decisions? I admit, I sometimes get tired of this. Does this really get us anything useful? Stop this. For your own sake. Yeah, you're right. Call it off. At least for now. <laughs> Paragon points, yay! If you're buying prisoners, can you buy me? Man, I, I don't care where you take me or what you do to me. It's gotta be better than this. We're here for Jack. Sorry. Jack? Forget what I just said. I don't want to go nowhere with you. I should go. <laughs> Wish I could go. And you just... I hear the screaming in my head. It's nice. Yeah. Okay! He's a nutcase.